Well, here's a revelation for you. What I consider to be healthy eating is different from what different. Brittany considers healthy eating. <laughs> and what I think of healthy eating is probably different from what you consider healthy eating. The point is, there are many different ways to live a healthy lifestyle. That's why each month we ask the healthy lifestyle experts at Pomegranate Market to learn more about healthier living. Today, Mike Howard is here to tell us about dairy-free alternatives in our diet. Very fun, very interesting. So, so what this is this this whole world has changed a lot. Yeah. I mean, it's just like from I think it went from soy milk or something like our almond milk. I mean, now you've got multiple varieties. Why would you know, how did this come to be that we had to replace, start replacing yeah. dairy? Yeah, what are some of the reasons? Why yeah. Well, there's all kinds of different allergies out there. So, I mean, some people who might be, um, you know, a little bit sensitive to uh, lactose also have an almond allergy. So, okay. Um, you know, so coconut milk. But the uh, another reason would be, you know, several different flavor profiles. Um, you know, I can use my wife as, as an example. She doesn't like nuts. Not milks very much, but she can drink rice milk. Um, so, you know, you, you just get a, a wide variety of, of options, and, and we all kind of, you know, choose for ourselves what we like and, and what. Yeah, because I sit there and I think about growing up as a kid, and it's just like you got the gallon of milk, that's what you drank, and we eventually mm -hmm. went from whole milk to 2% to skim. And, I mean, we just changed, you know, as time went on from a health perspective that I didn't know any different. And, but right. now that I've kind of eliminated some of that stuff in my life, I, I do notice a difference from a health perspective. Sure. And we have some options right here. So what are some different milk alternatives that people can use if they want to be dairy-free? Well, anything from grains, you know, you got like the rice milk, you got um, hemp, um, you, you know, obviously the nut milks, so you can go, you know, almond milks are really popular. Coconut milks, I think right now, seem to be the, you know, from, from the retailer stand, seem to be the most popular that people are buying the most. Um, but you can get, you know, oat milks, um, you know, even macadamia nut milks, which is, uh, you know, really unique and kind of new. So right. are, is there any dairy in it whatsoever? Because no. you're calling it milk. I mean, it, just, it looks right. like it. <laughs> it's like you're using the word milk, and it's just, to me, it's milk. Yeah. It's, there's no dairy in it whatsoever. So, I mean, essentially, it's, you know, it's the, the grains or the nuts and, and some water, and they press it and makes that creamy, you know, substance yeah. that you, you know. Uh, it seems like milk. I mean... Yeah. You use it for recipe and you think it's milk. But there's a lot more than just milk when it comes to dairy products. So what are some other dairy-free options that you can get at Pomegranate Market? Well, I mean, there's, you know, you know probably over 100 items. I don't know. I, you know, I could count them, but there's quite a few. So several items. So if you decide, you know, you're not going to um, consume dairy, um, you know, for one reason or another, um, if you come see us at Pomegranate Market, you have questions, you want to know exactly what's, you know, you know, what, what can I do? I really like cheese. What are my options? Mm -hmm. You know, we've got dairy alternative cheeses, whether it be a nut cheese or, mm -hmm. you know, d just depending on what you like, you try different things. There's, there's pea protein based cheeses, all kinds of stuff. Um, there's, there's, you know, butter alternatives. There's alternatives um, to butter that, that are, you know, very similar to butter, taste like butter, but don't contain the proteins that, you know, cause the lactose intolerance. So, um, you know, we definitely have a lot of stuff that can help um, answer your questions, get you the right things. But it's not just for dairy items. Um, you know, y y say you like macaroni and cheese and you just want to whip up a box of macaroni and cheese. You know, there's several options for that. You know, Daya has, you know, um, several flavors, um, different options. You know, they've got the, the white cheddar, Alfredo style. Um, yeah, there's, you know, the, actually that box is cool. It works both oh. ways. Oh, cool. <laughs> you turn it the other way, yeah. <laughs> but, <laughs> but anyhow, I mean, you know, if you like ranch, ranch dressing and all of a sudden you're like, oh, my gosh, I can't have dairy. What am I going to do? Right. Um, there's a fantastic dairy-free, sugar-free, you know, um, ranch alternative, and that's Primal Kitchen products. And there's, and there's, n I mean, there's no chemicals in it. It's just all natural yeah. to get the same flavors that we know and like yeah. from getting rid of all that stuff and, and making it a healthier option. Absolutely. So you'd be surprised to find, you know, I mean, all the, a lot of the ingredients that are in the stuff you buy at um, a lot of stores, um, they're, they're not necessary. Mm -hmm. So, um, you know, I mean, a lot of that stuff is for, you know, it's a preservative or it's to make it a certain color right. or, mm -hmm. you know, um, you know what, there, there's a lot of different reasons that they, that they do it just to keep it, you know, the way it is, but um, the stuff that we that we carry at Pomegranate, it's, it's it's all pretty clean. I mean, the ingredients they're the things that just make it taste good right. and and, ha and contain the nutritional value that we need to. So I'm sitting here right now. Obviously, ice cream has yeah, dairy-free options, like, okay, and I'm like watching it melt. So yeah. we're gonna taste <laughs> test, and I will say I am one of the biggest ice cream lovers you will ever meet. And so 
me tasting this, I, I'll be able to tell. So if it tastes similar, I will let you know. Sounds good. So is that what right. we're going to do? We're going to yeah, taste, taste it? Taste test. Okay. It's the best day gonna, ever. Gonna, right. Which one are you going to okay, start with? Are we going to do them together? Yeah. All right. Should we like crisscross arms? Yes. There's no way. I'm taking second fiddle to the puppy now. Okay, oh. ready? That has something with coconut. Chocolate and coconut. That's good. Well, obviously good. you can see the chocolate piece of it in there. Yeah. Mike, come on in here. And here, I'll slide over a little bit. You can come Can I on. reveal the answer and see if we're right? It's not yet. Not yet. Okay, so let's do the next one. Okay. So that one I kind of guess is a chocolate. Okay. Salted caramel chocolate chip. This one's really yeah, that's good. Really good. Wow! Holy cow! Mmm. <laughs> mm-hmm. I want one more bite. <laughs> good hogging it. Okay, and then the last one. Well, this one looks like a looks cookies like grape. Cookies and cream. Yeah, cookies Did and cream. Did you say grape? Mm-hmm. Grapes. Oh, that's tasty too. Coffee bean. No, it's just it's just chocolate. It's got to be just chocolate mm -mm. chip. There's Oreo something coffee about it or mocha. This one's mm. my favorite. This tastes so good. All it of them taste, taste like I'm ice I'm going to go with Brittany on this. I hate to be the same. Yeah. <laughs> Why do so, you never want to be the same as me? So delicious, salted, caramel cluster. Chocolate with coconut milk. milk I was right. Yeah, that's good. Okay, now this one. This one we were a little stumped by. Yeah. So it was cookies and cream. Cookies and cream. That was with my original thought, milk but I don't know why it tasted wow. like some type of coffee. Yeah. It sure did. It I mean, it, it tasted amazing. fantastic. Amazing. I mean, do you hear this from others that have tried it that, I mean, you can't tell the difference yeah, between? Yeah, absolutely. And I will have people tell me that they prefer these over dairy oh, ice Oh, yeah. Creams. They're um, very silky. This one in particular um, is very popular. We Obviously, we sell a ton of it, but, mm -hmm. um, you know, it just has that, that cashew mm -hmm. milk actually just yeah. gives it so a, a nuttier flavor, and it just blends really well yeah. with, the, with the caramel and, yeah. and nuts. Yeah. Um, you know, wh one thing I, I just kind of want to throw out there, I mean, so most ice cream, pretty much all ice cream you buy at the stores does have added sugar um, right. mm -hmm. because that's where you get a lot sure. of that flavor. Um, but I, what did you guys think of the chocolate? It was good. Yeah, it I could taste the coconut part. But it wasn't as chocolatey as I'm probably yeah. used to. Right. So, so that, that one's actually, really, it, it is a coconut milk ice cream, but that one actually has uh, zero, no added sugar whatsoever. Oh, wow. Okay. So if you're very on a very low sugar diet or you just choose not to consume yeah. added sugars, that one is, is natural sugars, which actually is probably less than one gram yeah. per serving. So, it's, All right. so I mean, imagine that. Really good ice cream, yeah. no Delicious. added sugar. Love it. All right. Well, thank you so much for bringing this in. Yeah. This is great. Yeah. Right. You don't need a membership to shop at Pomegranate Market. Their wide variety of organic, special diet and allergen-friendly foods is available to everyone. If you are not sure what you're looking for, be sure and ask any member of their friendly staff. You'll find them in the aisles at 57th and Louise Avenue in Sioux Falls. Give them a call at 605-275-0200 or check them out online at www.pomegranatemarkets.com. Pomegranate Market is hosting a special event tomorrow. It's Dairy Free Day. Stop by the store anytime between 11 a.m. and 2 p.m. and you'll be able to taste some of these dairy-free options for yourself. Their staff will also be on hand to answer any questions you may have about the dairy-free selections they offer.